I ordered something from Bolt.com. Let's go and unpack it. Well, that sort of worked. It's the SSD from Crucial. All right, let's go install this thing. I got the drive here. I found the USB to SATA controller adapter thingy. Well, let's unpack this, connect it to that thing and plug it in on the new iMac. Well, there we go. That was easy. Let's plug it in. I have an empty USB port. It should mount on the system right now. Let's switch to the desktop view. To add a new disk to the system requires you to initialize it and that's what we're gonna do here. So we have to go to disk utility, select a drive and erase it, which will create a partition after which we can actually use the drive. Another step that I like to do is encrypt my drives. This SSD disk is on a USB 3 cable, so let's do a little speed test. It seems to be doing around 400 megabytes per second, which is pretty good, but let's connect it to my USB-C port. Moving it to the USB Type-C port seems to be giving it a significant boost, so I'm quite happy with that. What I really like about this setup is that with a little bit of cable management you can just tuck the SSD behind the iMac and out of sight and this minimalistic look, I really like it. 